Well, uh, today, <laughs> today I'm going to be doing a little drawing, and uh, I thought about uh, making the theme of this video uh, a, an instructional video on how to sharpen a pencil, because that's the that's the main thing in this drawing is sharpening my pencil. I've been doing these drawings for many years and I have always done them on this kind of paper which we talked about in the other video the Reeves BFK white paper and this video I mean this this drawing that I'm working on is a drawing for a uh, grandchild and uh, I am uh, I've been working on it and I got sidetracked on other projects, but I'm getting back to it now. I have, uh, I have never worked with anything on this paper in drawing except these kind of pencils. Uh, different brands maybe, but drawing pencils. Mostly uh, 2B, 2, 2B is kind of soft. Mostly I would work with HB to lay down, to lay down an overall uh, layer of graphite pencil drawing and be very flat and then I would come back and put put the uh, darker I would darken it up with 2b and then I go over it again with 4b and even on some of the really intense dark areas I would use 6b but it's always pencil and I always use the point of the pencil very sharp and thus that's what I was talking about uh, making uh, making sure I uh, sharpen the pencil and I have my sharpener right here. I keep the pencil nice and sharp, and uh, I use the point of the pencil. It's like uh, I would normally have a lamp over here, but not for the video. But the, the the pencil, I use the pencil point. I don't use the side of the pencil for shading. I don't smear with my fingers for shading. I simply use the point in making tiny little circles over and over and over and over and over for ad infinitum tons of little circles and I just cut it's like coloring with a color crayon you just color 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 and if you want it darker you just press down harder but if you want a lighter area you have to lighten up go very light or go to a lighter pencil now I've got kind of got a layer of dust over here because I haven't been working I've got a couple of projects I was working on in addition to this main drawing here I have these uh, have these little, I have these little drawings that I'm doing of uh, collars, uh, shirt collars on various photos from the 1950s from people, I uh, assume they were relatives of some kind. Uh, they were from uh, pictures from my mother, but I'm doing their collars, their shirt collars. This is, uh, this is one here, and this is a piece of paper getting ready to do one. And I've got a, uh, I've got one already finished somewhere here, but that's a side project. That's just a little, little personal project I've been working on. The main thing that I'm doing in this drawing is this, is this drawing here of my, of my uh, daughter, granddaughter, and she is. Uh, there's one of my, one of my collars. Uh, she is. Uh, 11. She's 11 years old now, and I told her I would do a portrait of her when she was eight. And so it's taken me. I'm still working on it at, uh, three years later. But uh, I'm, I'm using reference that I took last summer when I went uh, to visit them, and I've already done uh, paintings. I did paintings of the the two other girls, and I'm doing this drawing. And I'm sure they want a painting, but I got this idea for doing a drawing with a, a cutout a masonite, painted masonite background that I'm gonna mount this onto with some plexiglass over it and uh, see how that works out. I, uh, I hope it turns out okay, but uh, I'm just uh, involved in doing this drawing and it's kind of been on the sidetrack side because I had to finish my print and then I have to finish the big painting and I've got my drawing over here kind of in limbo. It's just waiting. It's uh, almost done. As you can see, as you can see, it's, uh, it's quite a bit advanced and I've got some finishing touches to do and uh, actually want to do another one uh, of the same image. 
but uh, that's another story for another video. Anyway, uh, these are my pencils. I, I, I just sh sit here and uh, sharpen my pencils and uh, make little circles with my pencils over and over and over and over and get really bored, but uh, this is what it comes out to. And I've been doing these for many, many years. Uh, the original ones were huge, as big as this table that I was doing those drawings. And uh, slowly I've made them smaller and smaller because it takes so long to do them. And uh, that's about it for the drawing. <laughs>